We'll give her a little bit of acceleration, see how she goes. Good morning, just arrived today at Toehead Turners. We've got one of the Garner Douglas Mark IV Euro chassis. This particular one has got some lovely P700 headlamps, some clear indicators. This, this particular car has been fitted with the flat bonnet, no bonnet scoop, as, a, as did the original AC427 street cars, mainly come out with no bonnet scoop. It's optional to add a scoop if someone particularly wanted it. The Garner Douglas Mark IV Euro chassis means that the chassis uses Garda Douglas's own hubs and brake and suspension setup. You can probably just see through there that this particular one's got AP racing brakes with grooved and vented discs on the front. Also, disc outboard disc brakes on the rear. This car's fitted with a stainless steel underfloor exhaust system, which helps expel all the noise behind you um, and gives the car the sleeker look down the side. Frenched in Aston style flip top fuel filler cap. Um, Frenched into the bodywork, gives it that original Cobra look. This car's got Garner Douglas's twin three leg stainless steel roll bars. This one's got the integrated headrests and the seat belt mounts, um, making it a really uniform look to the car. show you around the inside of the car. So the Garner Douglas uses very much like a spider chassis design. So you've got this quite tall tabletop central transmission tunnel area. This Garner Douglas has got an adjustable steering column so you can move the steering column up and down to get the best driving position. It's also got all the ETB classic instruments with the modern push style aluminium buttons. This particular car has got a six-speed Tremec manual gearbox. This particular car is fitted with an electric handbrake, which just simply push the button and the handbrake releases. The power plant of this Cobra is one of the modern Chevrolet LS3 engines. The benefit to the LS3 is it's a light aluminium block, um, fuel injection, modern technology, individual coal packs, um, a very good, reliable and powerful light V8 unit. I think we should take her for a spin. This is a very modern feeling car to drive. Um, much more like a modern car with an injection engine, um, more modern design of chassis, uh, much closer to the sort of modern cars that you drive rather than an original Cobra. We'll give her a little bit of acceleration, see how she goes. Very good handling car, very direct on the steering, um, very linear power from the LS3, uh, much more linear than the carbureted engines that come in a little bit more ferociously on the power band, uh, but very easy car to drive. If you'd like to learn more about this Cobra and lots of other Cobras and GT40s that we do, go to our website which is www totalheadturners.com you can also follow us on instagram facebook youtube just search total head turners and you'll find us out there see you soon